I think it's time. I think it's time I finally went over it. What is the difference between a side hustle and a side business or side gig? And why is this information important? If this is, is, if this is something that you're interested in learning more about, listen, you wanna keep watching. Hello everyone, my name is Jackie. I am a life and business coach. I have an MBA with a GCPA, which is a graduate in accounting. Um, I've spent 20 years helping people excel in the corporate world. And I took uh, many of my experience, like freeing myself over $200 and four thousand dollars of debt um freeing myself from depression and, and getting productive and put them together and created programs or training right this channel here it's all about taking your life and your business back with your pen because it's my personal mission my goal to empower you, to help you get productive, help you get the training you need and help you create a scalable business online. So y'all, let's get into this topic. Y'all, it feels like it's been forever since I talked to you all, since I seen your beautiful faces. I know, I know I'm on, I'm on YouTube. I can't see your faces, but to hear your comments, to get you to see me, to be in this space with you right now is amazing. Um, if you have not subscribed to me, I want to invite you to subscribe, subscribe and click the notification bell so that you'll know when another broadcast post because like I said I'm here to help you get productive help you get trained and help you create a scalable business online because these training tactics this information is how are you take your life and your business back okay so our goal we have two missions today first I'm going to find the side hustle or side gig and tell you the difference between it and a side business and why is this information is important important okay so first i want to give you all where this came from okay so on instagram i started post so i started on youtube posting videos about side hustle. It went wonderful, right? It's doing well. So I started posting similar information on Instagram. It went wah, wah, wah. And the reason, so the analytical side of me said, okay, Jackie, it's time for you to sit on the review. So I went into my imaginary couch, right? <laughs> anyway, so I started reviewing my um, Instagram and guess what happened? My account got deactivated. Luckily, I had another account, right? So I want you all that are following me on Instagram, make sure you start following me on this other Instagram page. It's called Jackie McKeever Speaks, right? That's Jackie McKeever Speaks. I'm going to put it down in the description. Okay, so a side hustle. A side hustle is, basically a side hustle is uh, making, when you make money alongside of your main source of income, right? Or your main source of, of, of employment, right? They refer to, people refer to it as a side hustle. Sometimes people call these side gigs, right? And generally, 
and generally um generally these side hu- i'm gonna call them side hustles and not say side gigs but just know that those words are interchangeable so um the reason why it's called a side hustle or a side gig is because generally those they could be uh, occasionally sometimes i've heard people call side hustles um they hobbies even if they monetize them and they refer to them as uh their hobbies as a side hustle is because uh according to the amount that they made like if they made like peanuts you know like maybe uh balanced out whatever they did they sold it for what they would it cost them to make it they may still call it a hobby but if they sold it for a little bit more and they don't all they're not really serious about it they may call it a side a side hustle but it's basically money you make alongside um uh, sometimes it's done occasionally um sometimes but most of the time your side hustle is not your main sources of income, right? Um, And sometimes, you know, people refer to side hustles because it's some type of work or some type of activity to, uh, to get income that people choose to do temporarily. For example, um, I had a side hustle. I used to work for a delivery a food delivery service. I had no intention on keeping that that job more than six months, right? Um, one of the reasons why I got the job is because I was selling one of my houses, right? I was selling a home. And I wanted to make sure at the time when I had got the gig, I was not in uh, financial ruin. <laughs> ruin. But I wanted, because I freed myself of $204,000 in debt before, I knew that I did not want that house to be an issue. So I went and got me a side gig, which was a food delivery service, um, temporary with that goal. And I referred to it as my side hustle because it wasn't my uh, main source of income, right? And it could be all, you can do all, uh, lots of different types. It doesn't have to be one time. It doesn't have to be something that you can do. Because I was doing mine like 20 hours or, more, or a little bit more a week because I had a goal in mind, right? So a side business is, is really the basically the same thing. And the only difference between your side hustle and side gig um, is probably your emotion or your thoughts with it, right? Um, because with the with the side business, sometimes people use that um, because when they don't actually have, they may or may not have another job. Uh, but they do have other commitments that may not be something that they're really committed to. And they may call it, oh, that's my side business. You know, um, oftentimes they, if they're making money from something that they did from a hobby, they may call it their side business. But like I said, side business, side gig, side gig, side hustle, um, those are really interchangeable. Um, Sometimes people use that term when they are doing the activity part-time, right? And listen, but the main difference between the two uh, as far as a side hustle and a side business is when they put that business term in, they've actually, it's actually a business, right? Right. And we're going to talk more about that later. So if you have not subscribed and click the notification bell, please take this time and click the uh, subscribe and click the notification bell because I'm here to give you valuable information, right? I'm not here to give you baloney. I, I don't want to waste your time because to me, money is time, right? But, and I get mad a lot of times when I hear 
some people get on Instagram or get on one of the social media platforms and they say, oh, you're just doing a hobby or you're just doing a side gig. That is not a business. Okay, so let's dig a little bit deeper on this business term, right? So a, a business, now I'm gonna give you the IRS, okay? Now they are officials when it comes. Okay, so according to them, when you are generating, doing an activity carried, uh, carried, carrying on an activity where you, there is an exchange of services or product, right? and you're doing it in a manner to make profit. Guess what? That is a business, right? So a side hustle is a business. A side business is a business, right? So why is that information important to you all? You may be asking. So, one of the reasons why it's important for you to know that information is according also to according to the IRS. If you make, okay, so another word for being a side hustler, you may be self-employed, you may be a, a independent contractor. Okay, so according to the IRS, um, if you make over, if you earn, and it used to be higher than this, but now if you earn above $400, uh, you owe self-employment tax. And the tax is 15.3%, right? So I don't want you to get hung up on the terms, like whether side hustle, side business, independent contractor, um, self-employed, whatever. The only time those terms are really important, they're important when you're paying Uncle Sam, when you're paying your taxes, and they're important to whatever customer you have, right? So for example, if I was doing business, if you were doing business um, with the government, the government refers to those people who are not employees as contractors or independent contractors right because they're not immediately or uh officially affiliated with the government right they're doing a job for them so if your customer is using contractor or independent contractor you want to use those terms because this is your source of income but i don't want you to get too hung up on those but I had to address that because of the reaction. I just believe that maybe a lot of people did not know the difference, right? Um, another thing, the reason why that's important to you is um, when you listen to training and when you listen to people, I want you to understand what they're saying to you, right? And be able to discern um, or figure out what is factual and what is not factual, right? And be comfortable with the decisions that you're, you're making because it's all about taking your life and your business back, right? So you have to decide what's best for you. What's best for Billy, what's best for Linda may not be best for you. Okay, so at, at, speaking of what's best for you, it's important that... Uh, you decide what best side is because there's tons of them, right? And all of them are great, right? There's tons of side hustles or side gigs, right? I created a video to help you decide which side hustle is best for you. And you'll either find it over here, definitely in the description and definitely at the end of this video. Um, another thing is, not only that, is I have a free gift, all because you got to this part of the video, right? 
free gift all because you, you listened to this part of, you got to this point in the video. It's 21, 20 ways to make money, make, uh, make 1K in a few weeks, right? Yes, I'm giving you, I'm not only giving you training or video training to help you determine which gig is best for you. I'm giving you 20 ways that I, uh, 20, I'm giving you ways that I personally use to free myself of over $204,000 in debt, right? I'm giving you ways to make $1,000 in just a few weeks, right? This is your work. And I'm also giving you the opportunity to watch this free training, free training on helping you decide which side hustle is best for you, right? Now, in order to get the PDF that lists side hustles, excuse me, I thought my phone was off, side hustles that are best for you, you want to go into the description and click on the link, the link, and put your email information in there, your name and email information, and, and you'll get immediate access. It'll send you immediately the PDF, right? And you'll also get training videos. Another video you want to make sure you check out, and I'm going to put that into the description, is how to balance your full-time job and your side hustle while you're being productive. It'll be down in the description. And it may or may not be at the end of this video, but it'll definitely be in the description. Because, and the reason why I'm giving you this is because I want to continue to connect with you. I want you to be successful. It's, uh, it's the end of the year. And it's time for you to step out and start living your dream life, right? It's time for you to be purposeful. It's time to you to, for you to get to planning and live the life that you desire, okay? And also to help you do that, I'm participating from December the 14th to December the 25th in Vlogmas, or in my case, business, right? Well, I'm going to be talking to you, uh, giving you some things, some self-development, uh, a lot of business training on how to just do that. So make sure you subscribe and click the notification bell so that you won't miss out on future training.